People in Lee County are trying to learn more about their legal options surrounding Chinese drywall in their homes. Miami-based attorney David Durkee is working with homeowners all over the state who are considering lawsuits. Durkee is telling them to get the facts while also warning them about scam artists trying to profit from their misfortune. People are getting ripped off because they're scared. They're paying people to investigate their homes and paying hundreds if not thousands of dollars. Durkee says most legal action is against builders because of the defective drywall product. He says health-related personal injury cases take much longer and are harder to prove. Meanwhile, Florida Senator Bill Nelson wants more tests done on Chinese drywall. He's asking for $2 million to go to the Consumer Product Safety Commission. The test would find out what's in the drywall that could cause people to get sick. Senator Nelson wants drywall subjected to heat and humidity to see what kind of chemicals are baked off. I am very allergic to mold and mildew. I can walk in a moldy room and I, uh, my respiratory system starts clogging up. Same thing happened to me when I went into these houses. Senator Nelson says many families who rebuilt after hurricanes in 2004 and 2005 have Chinese drywall. He says they've been forced out of their homes because of health problems.